The challenge we have today is the companies aren't aware of the technologies and how they can take advantage of, of them. So the question is, are you going to be the disruptor or the disrupted? So they're moving so quickly, you can't wait to see what happens. You have to actually sense them and then actually attack and develop your own strategy. There's disruption in you know, very advanced technologies, but also in classical models. If you actually look at travel agents as an example, travel agents in the US have gone down by 50% at the exact same time as Expedia exploded by four times the growth. So you can see new, new technologies are actually disrupting traditional businesses. There are some major technologies that we're tracking, so things like virtual reality. How do I actually, inside a set of goggles, how do I provide a very compelling experience and that actually changes how the user thinks about the product or the experience? We've seen everyone from the food bank that recreated an environment where a, one of their customers passed out in the food bank because there weren't enough people out in the, uh, in the audience. When they showed that to potential donors, everyone actually reached down to touch the person, and then at the end of the experience, they were so engaged in it that they actually provided more money than they would have seen normally in, in their uh, charitable receipts. We've seen people like beer commercials where they actually take the experience of understanding how to live in an Irish pub and what it looks and feels like, transport that experience all the way to the Soviet Union and they can start to understand what that experience looks like and when you take away the augmented reality you can actually have a physical person there that's just like you were in the pub. All of this starts with actually experiencing the technologies and the capabilities, so trying it, right? So whether it's the augmented or the virtual reality Oculus Rift goggles, whether it's trying something with 3D printing, whether it's leveraging crowdsourcing, you actually have to get your hands dirty. So the brand should be thinking about it. We do programs called the Discovery Zone where we actually take a number of executives out and have them experience an Uber or an Airbnb or a different kind of uh, customer experience, leveraging the technologies that are available. And once the executives start to see the technology, all kinds of new ideas come forth.